How are you feeling? You got John Riggs here. Nobody is more excited than I am that video game conventions are coming upon us here right quick. I'm already slated to be at a few of them later on this year. Not all of them. I can't attend all of them, but I'm slated to be at a few. I'll tell you which ones those are coming up here in just a little bit and a way for you to vote and you decide which convention I should attend, and then we're gonna make that happen. The last convention I attended was a Portland swap meet. It was just a one day show, chill atmosphere, not quite the Portland Retro Gaming Expo, but a lot of the same organizers put together this one day show. It happens in January, uh, January 2020, so it was about a year and a half ago. Didn't even get a chance to go to PAX East, and PAX East was kind of like the last major one before everything shut down. But now that things are a lot more safer to get out there and actually shake some hands for the first time, not just digitally, but we're actually face to face and everything, um, we're, we're gonna make this happen, man. And as I said earlier, I'm gonna give you the chance to vote and decide which convention I should attend. Maybe it's one I've never been to. Maybe it's one that I haven't been to in a while, but you're gonna make that vote. This contest and this video wouldn't exist without today's sponsor, Raid Shadow Legends. Raid is available free for mobile and PC. It's a turn-based RPG, just like those old school RPGs that we grew up with, right? Only without the lame fetch quests, just hardcore action. Hundreds of artifacts to equip, over 500 champions with unique skills, build your team, level your champion, raid your way. In fact, use my link in the description below to download Raid for yourself to your mobile phone or PC again, totally free to play. And even though Raid has over a million active players daily, the time to play is right nizzle. This month, Raid's doing it big heading into summer. Ton of new content as always. They've got a bunch of new champions coming out. There's also a new rotation of the Doom Tower, definitely worth checking out. Summon as many new champions as possible to see if they can help you reach the top. It's what I've got to do. If you want to get a huge head start on Raid, all you got to do is check out the link in the description below, or easy enough, scan this QR code, this one right here, and you'll get this epic hero, Chonaru, just who you'll need for the Doom Tower. Along with Chonaru, you'll also get 200,000 silver, one XP boost, one energy refill, and an ancient shard so you can summon an awesome champion as soon as you get in-game. This is only available for first-time players and only in the next 30 days. You gotta get on it right now. You'll find it all right there in your inbox. That's where everything's gonna be. And then my name, John Blue Riggs, make sure you look me up. We can rate together. Super easy, click the link in the description and we'll see you in the game. This flyaway, this video wouldn't even be possible without Raid Shadow Legends. So make sure you show them some love. So the conventions I'll be attending later on this year. You can find me for the first time ever in Greenville, South Carolina. Southeast Game Exchange. Are you kidding me on this one? July 10th and 11th. I'm looking forward to it. I guess there's a food there called Hop and John. I gotta try that. That's my name, right? Southeast Game Exchange has an action-packed guest list as a kind of a who's who of what's going down in YouTube right now. So make sure you check out their guest list. I want to see you there. For the first time ever, I'll be at Retropalooza Houston. That's coming up later on this year, July 24th and 25th. Houston, Texas, I'm looking for legit barbecue and great local beer. Can you can you provide that? I'm sure we can find some. It'll be my first Houston experience and my first Retropalooza experience. Now this one's Retropalooza Houston. They also have Retropalooza proper, like in Arlington, the Dallas-Fort Worth area. Don't worry about it. I'm gonna be there too. Retropalooza proper, Retropalooza prime. Let's just call it Retropalooza. How about that? October 23rd and 24th, I'll be at that one as well. I'm looking forward to it. Now, not exactly a video game convention, but I'm also going to be at VidSummit later on this year. Now, VidSummit isn't a video game convention. It's a YouTube convention, and it kind of teaches you how to suck less at YouTube, something I need all the help in the world with, right? <laughs> it's gonna be a fun time. It's September 28th through the 30th. It's happening in Los Angeles. It's called Vid Summit. Um, I'm gonna be there. I'm, at, I'm attending just as a student because I'm really interested in hearing these panels and um, hearing just how to how to do YouTube and content creation, uh, maximize you know what, what's already in front of me. How can I make it better? And non-confirmed, I'm hoping I can go to Renton City Retro. Now Renton City Retro, um, it's gonna be a great show. It's only a one-day show this year. It's August 14th in beautiful Renton, Washington. It may be the only video game convention in all of Washington State for the entire year. I've gone the previous years. It's just a one day show, super chill, super cool. I like the town of Renton. I'm looking forward to being there. I'm looking forward to hopefully being there. Again, I haven't confirmed for sure because um, it's happening in the middle of August and I might, I may be doing something else during that week, but if I'm there, I'm there. How about that? And at these shows, I'm showing up. I'm bringing some of my games with me. This is Yeah Yeah Beavis 2. I haven't really talked about this game much. It's the homebrew that I've been working on for the last while with a ton of help to make this thing a reality. Fun game. It is completed. It's finished. 100 levels. Um, I'm looking forward to showing this off to you, and I'm waiting for boxes and manuals to come in, but it does work, and I did promise that I would do a contest where I put someone in this game 
Um, so it's the game, but instead of the main characters, it's you and a friend, or you and your wife, or you and someone else. I'll, I'll, I still plan on doing that contest. I'm just waiting for boxes and manuals to show up, but that'll, that'll come soon. And I'm hoping to bring a bunch of these with me to these conventions, and more games too, of course. So that opens up to what convention should I attend? And thanks to today's sponsor, Raid Shadow Legends, they're actually providing the funds for me to fly and grab a hotel. A couple of conventions I can't attend this year, unfortunately, are Video Game Summit in Chicago. That's happening July 17th. Classic Game Fest. I've heard a ton of great things about Classic Game Fest. Uh, it's happening on July 24th and 25th. If you live in those areas, please still attend those. I can't be there because they're on the same days or weekends of other conventions I'm already attending. It happens maybe next year. We'll, we'll see. So here are the conventions that I will attend if it gets the most votes. Southern Fried Gaming Expo. Now this is happening in Atlanta, Georgia, August 20th through the 22nd. I have never been to Atlanta, Georgia. No, that's not true. I've been in the airport. I had a layover in Atlanta once. Doesn't count. <laughs> <laughs> but Southern Fried Gaming Expo, I've heard I've heard great things about it. A uh, huge pinball area, huge arcade area. Um, I don't know a lot about it, but I do know that it looks like my kind of show, and it's happening in Atlanta. So if that's on the list, if that's what the one, and maybe you live closer to that one, go ahead and mark that one. We have Mo Game Con Junior now. Mo is Missouri. It's the Missouri Game Con. It happens near, uh, well, we say St. Louis. It's usually like St. Charles or something like that. Somewhere in the vicinity of St. Louis, Missouri. I've gone to the Missouri Game Con a couple of times and loved it. Loved the, I, I fell in love with the area. Uh, the people are always super cool. I just like the area a lot. And this year, because of all the impact happening, they're planning on doing maybe a smaller scale show, but between now and then, who knows? I don't expect a guest invite just because of everything that's happening right now, but I still may attend. So that's gonna be one of the ones on the list. I have no problem going back to St. Louis. October 2nd and 3rd is the Pittsburgh Gaming Expo. And of course, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Beautiful area, I think. I've never been there. Um, it's a beautiful neighborhood, I suppose. <laughs> is, isn't Pittsburgh? Isn't that where Mr. Rogers is from? Well, this is a convention that's been going on for a few years. It's getting bigger and bigger every year. Um, from what I understand, a new venue this year and everything like that, I've never been. So. So why not? I looked up flights and um, my fl my flights go straight to Pittsburgh, so I'm cool with that. Maybe maybe consider that one, huh? Also in Pennsylvania is Too Many Games. Now Too Many Games is in Oaks, technically, right near Philadelphia. Um, great time. I went there in 2019. I did a video on that. Had a blast. Again, it's it's one of the best conventions. I mean, I, I will always have love for the Portland Retro Gaming Expo, but the Too Many Games Expo is, I think, square footage-wise bigger and there's a wrestling ring and it's just a fantastic fantastic show and a lot of a lot of youtubers on the east coast all meet at that one whether they're guests or not uh when i went in 2019 i was not a guest i just showed up and um and this time i'll just show up again and just just kind of hang out why not too many games that's gonna be one of those on the list and the next two are interesting enough we have midwest gaming classic midwest gaming classic in milwaukee wisconsin this one's going down november 6th and 7th this one prides themselves on how big it is uh, the huge arcade and pinball and all that. Um, it's it's another one that I know a lot of people who fly into Milwaukee just for this convention. They all fly in, meet up with everyone. Great time to be had. Midwest Gaming Classic. It's it's one of the staple conventions uh, in the in the United States. And then we also have Retro World Expo. I've heard so many great things about Retro World Expo, Hartford, Connecticut. It's happening November fifth through the seventh. And what a great time to be had. Man, I'm, I'm looking forward to being there. The reason those two are interesting is because they're both on the same weekend. So you can only do one or the other. But in this case, those are six conventions that are up for grabs. You vote for the one that I should attend. And after the voting ends, when the voting ends, that's the one I'm going to. I, I mean, I, like I said, Raid Shadow Legends. I mean, they're, they're sponsoring my flight. They're sponsoring my trip. They're sponsoring me being a guest or a fan or both at one of those six conventions. So you make your vote known. You let me know. Whatever one I attend, that's where I'm going, man. Thank you so much, and we'll see you real soon. I hope we'll, I hope we'll actually see each other face-to-face -face real soon. How about that?